Hi, this is Subin from the Minic team, and today we're going to introduce the new R2 iOS with Simon from the R2 8 team. Hi, Simon. Hi, it's Simon. So, the product you're going to introduce today is the R2 iOS, which is our new intraoral scanner. Yes, today I'm going to introduce simple guidance and installation for you. So, let's unbox together to see the components. Okay, so here is this scanner, dongle, power adapter, scanner chip, cradle, USB memory, and USB cables. So what's inside the USB? Could you show it to us? Yes, let's check it together. So the installation manual, and the installation video, and the Quake user's manuals are provided in English, Italian, and French. Also, we can see that there's installation file and the team viewer. Yes, team viewer is automatically installed when you install the software. So, let's install the software. Wow, that was quick. I can see the team viewer installed on the desktop. Now, let's install the scanner. So plug in the power and connect the C-type USB cable with the scanner. Then, connect the black cable to the laptop. Just like you said, this is very quick and simple. Next, plug the dongle and run the software. So are there any precautions? Yes. If you don't plug the dongle or if your fish spec is inadequate, the software will not run. So I will introduce a simple how to use with scanning. Create patient and then enter the patient name. So what kind of scan modes does R2 iOS have? There are restoration mode, orthodontics mode, and implant mode. So there's tooth number on the right. Do you have to select the tooth number? It's not necessary. However, you can import this data from ExoCAD. Let's start the scanning. Wow. It's very quick and simple to scan. What kind of features are there? i iOS has very fast speed focusing. So you mean it focuses very fast even if it changes the scanning surfaces? Yes, you're right. So what are those purple parts? Unscan the areas. So for the important areas like margins and contacts, you can additionally scan it again? Yeah, just like this. I'm going to scan the antagonist. So you're assuming your hand as tongue or cheek. So does it automatically delete those parts? Yup is the AI filtering function. So using this function, the scanning time decreases and user's convenience increases. Could you show another special function? It's preview function, which you can check the refined data in just 3 seconds. This is a very useful function that allows you to check important areas such as margins and contacts in advance but rather than waiting for the entire rendering time. Now, let's scan the bite. That's it? Yep. So for partial cases, you can scan the bite just once. And for full cases, you scan twice. Exactly. If you check the correct bite, select the refine check. So with the refine function, it's neatly processed and looks very precise.
Can it be also saved in color? It's possible to store not only SDL, but also PLY, OBJ color data at the same time. For us, we have checked this R2iOS out together. It definitely makes digital impressions very simple and easy. With an intuitive UI, R2iOS is very fast and simple, so anyone can easily and quickly acquire high-precision data. And its compatibility is high, so there's no restrictions on its use. So if you're looking for a high-speed, easy-to-use, and fast intraoral scanner, R2iOS is what you're looking for. Search R2iOS on Artscape Facebook, and if you need any questions or any technical support, please contact Simon at Artscape Facebook Messenger, and they're, help they're there to help you. Thank you so much for your help, Simon. Thank you.